new gem from the latest treasure box. Let's find out what it is. I always hope for something exciting, but let's see if this one plays along. First, I test with the polariscope. It's anisotropic, but no matter how I twist or turn it, I can't find the optic axis. Lately, I'm quite unlucky or just impatient with the conoscope. Then, I check for pleochroism. Nothing. Under the dichroscope, the color stays exactly the same. Next up, refractive index. I take four readings. The highest of the highs is 1.55 and the low is 1.541 with no variability. That makes it uniaxial positive with a birefringence of 0.009. Perfect. Refractive index alone doesn't give me a definitive verdict, so I move on to specific gravity. In air, it weighs 1.415 carats and underwater 0.88, which gives me a specific gravity of 2.64. And I double checked to be sure. Now we're getting somewhere. The refractive index, specific gravity and anisotropic behavior all suggest quartz. Quartz is actually the second most abundant mineral in Earth's crust after feldspar. Under the microscope, I confirm it's natural full of beautiful inclusions and a few scratches that show it's had a life. 